No one's ever tried this before. You're about to watch a glass cannon fire a tennis ball. Sounds crazy, right? Because it is. One spark, and this whole thing could either launch or completely explode. You can almost feel the pressure building inside that jar, every matchstick head turning into potential chaos. You keep watching, waiting for that fuse to hit the mix, wondering if it'll actually survive the blast. But before you see what happens, you need to know how this was even possible. Because building a cannon out of glass shouldn't work. Yet somehow it does. You don't need a PhD to know this is a terrible idea. And that's exactly why you should watch. This jar used to hold cookies. Now it's holding a very questionable plan. Inside the chamber are matchstick heads, hundreds of tiny drama starters. Together they're less science and more mildly terrifying art project. Look at it sitting there, all innocent. It's the kind of thing that makes your common sense whisper. Maybe don't, while your brain screams, do it for the video. You're here for that tension, that tiny voice that says this shouldn't exist, but also kinda wants to see what happens when it does. It's the same energy as the guy who built a robot that throws cheese slices at him every morning, not because it's useful but because it could be done. Or the person who made a drone that follows their cat around just to play dramatic music whenever it jumps on furniture. There's no reason behind it, except pure chaotic curiosity. And honestly, that's all the motivation you ever need. If this were a product, it would fail every safety test and still get 5 stars for entertainment value. It's gloriously dumb, dangerously creative, and perfectly tuned for one explosive moment of chaos, and you know you want to see it. Now don't get me wrong, this looks reckless, because it is. Don't try this at home, seriously, no one needs a fireball and a trip to the emergency room. But while you're here, enjoy the absurdity, the jar that once held cookies, now plotting to launch a tennis ball into orbit. You're watching someone willingly test the line between genius and please don't. And that's what makes it beautiful, that little spark of madness that makes you think, maybe I should try something insane too. And here's the wild part. This isn't just any glass cannon. As far as we know it's the only one on YouTube that actually works. People have built glass launchers before, but they all end the same way. A loud crack, a puff of smoke, and someone saying well, that didn't go as planned. This one, it fires. A real tennis ball powered by matchstick heads, out of a cookie jar cannon. So if you ever wondered what impossible looks like in slow motion, you're about to find out. 